What is going on my weebles? This is your boy Rumpus. Welcome back to Rumpus Room. Today we're right back at it again. Part 2, Episode 1. Look at him. He shook after that last encounter. It's me. Batman's got some serious psychological problems, though, if you ever really think about it. Rumpus. And I mean, uh, how could you blame him? His parents getting shot down in cold blood right in front of him when he's a kid. Realm of Shadows. Another brutal week in Gotham, folks. A string of home invasions rippled through the city's already crime-infested East End. Apparently, the bandits are using stolen GCPD battery we got here? To Theater tickets. With break-in entry incidents up 40% over last year. Remember, oh, shit. I was slow. Those are the tickets that, uh... From his parents the night they got killed, I'm sure. This evening after a break-in at City Hall. But thanks to the efforts of the Batman, the stolen items were returned. Not all of them. Let's see what she was really after. Ah, he kept some shit. Alright, retrieve the data. Right. Selena Kyle, the cat Betty Larson, new criminal in this seat, has several others. recent break-ins. She's effective and doesn't leave any clues behind her currently, but GCPD has no leads. Which I knew more about it. Oswald Coppelpot. Oh, that was the penguin? I knew I knew that name, Oswald. Cool, cool. Alright. I don't think we need to breathe. Mm. Y'all can pause it and read this stuff if you want. I'll probably go back and look at it myself. But, uh, I want to get moving on. Alright. Oh, wait. I think I missed something. What's this update? Oh, Random no, stabbings update. are the latest headache for the riders of Gotham's overcrowded huh. sky rail cars to contend with. Gotham police are investigating multiple cases yeah. of riders receiving a He's only 26 years old. He's doing well for himself. While pressed into the tight quarters with fellow nice. passengers. A few have died, while most right. have been admitted to Gotham General in critical condition. The police don't All have right. any suspects at the time. The back computer should be able to read whatever data is on that storm drive. Well, why didn't you just grab it and slam it in there, my man? I mean, like, what's up? You know what we're doing here, we Batman. Off a building for this? Make me come over here and pick it up. You know what's up. You're going to go over here and I'll bark some shit or my beer. Oh, whoops. All right. He needs a chair to access it with the data port. Gotta be comfortable when you're accessing data. That's why that was so important. Must be universal slot. Yeah, encrypted. Wayne Manor has seven bedrooms, two kitchens, a library, a gymnasium, a basketball court, and a movie theater. And yet I always find you here. In a dark, damp cave. In front of a computer. I'm more at home here than the rest of the house. You know that. I'm surprised there's then only seven bedrooms. Then we should build an eighth rooms. bedroom down here. Sure, I can see the headlines now. Bruce Wayne, billionaire, entrepreneur, cave dweller. Quite an eclectic resume. Did you find out what Indeed. that um, cat woman tried to steal? Well, in the process. What are we looking at? Let me try a different angle. The hell? Oh, 
Oh, what the fuck? He literally made a different angle, huh? Well, I mean... You want me to angle in? This is a map of the east side shoreline. But it could mean any number of things. Money, weapons, drugs, everything flows through that port. Maybe it's where Mayor Hill picks up his dry cleaning. Hmm. Can't make sense of it yet. There's still plenty of files to decrypt. Damn, not even 1%. And in the meantime... I saved you what I could. Think so. Yeah, the same couldn't be said for the bar. I had to literally pry Mrs. Zeller back away. But you'll be pleased to hear everyone has left, including Mr. Falcone. Before the game switched from billiards to cutthroat, I'd recommend leaving the fist fights to your alter ego. Bloodstains are much harder to remove from a tuxedo. I don't want anything to do with Falcone. Well, he certainly showed interest in you. That's what worries me. For yeah. the record, your father despised men like Falcone. Thought they ruined Gotham's stellar reputation. Back when it still had one? It can again, Bruce. Though people like this cat woman aren't helping. <laughs> just this Is she new to town? I've never seen her before. Hopefully, she's just a tourist. Oh, no, I already checked the codex. Not much to find, apparently. Mm -hmm. A few burglaries, break-ins... Seems to lay pretty low. You could learn a thing or two from her. You can't step outside without it ending up in the news lately. As Bruce yes, or yeah. Batman. That's not the point. I want criminals to know I'm out there. Batman isn't hiding from anybody. I was talking about Bruce. I don't mean to beat a dead argument, but... No one's gonna figure it out now. Trust me. Miss Vale noticed your injuries, so did Mr. Dent. If they put it together with the incident at the mayor's office, it would undo all the long nights and close calls we've endured to get here. You're in the spotlight more than ever. You have to be careful. You're right, you're right. I should have cancelled the event. But I know how much pressure you're under. I don't mean to add to it. It's okay. I, I know you're only looking out for me. If we make a suit that fits me, we can trade places some night. Though I'm not partial to heights. <laughs> <sighs> Old men worry, that's all. It's our gift and our curse. One more worry for the list. Alright, give it over. Alfred is pretty badass in that Gotham TV show. I thought I saw Oz. It's been what? 20 years. Last time I saw him, we were in grade school. Indeed. You two were thick as thieves. Oswald, however, took that role more literally than you. Dishonorable discharge, illegal boxing matches, arms dealing, prison stents? That's a criminal grand Come slam. On, you just if I'm using the expression correctly. Unfortunately, you are. Oswald claimed he only wanted to catch up, but... His behavior following his family's collapse is troubling. Why he's returning now, I haven't the faintest idea. I think he just wants to reconnect. Criminal record or not, he's still an old friend. A lot can change over the years. If I remember correctly, nah, Oswald crazy. was fond of the old firecrackers in the toilet trick. I worry what he's graduated to. Even though you and young Master Cobblepot used to be close, I'd advise you to be cautious. But I know you can't abandon a good mystery until it's solved. Oswald I'll be careful, and Alfred. Batman. I didn't when know. When you they see were what's friends. become of his park, I think you will. Maybe that's new to Telltale. I'd have to look it up later. Damn, that place is messed up. Cobble Pot Park. Where are you, Oz? He just comes there, dressed how he is. I guess he can take care of himself. 
Ah. <coughs> if that was that broad that I told her no no writing, she'll get a piece of my mind next time. Homeless person. I ain't giving you nothing. No. I don't think you need it right now. <laughs> that was mean. Yeah. Let me see if I can go back. I did use somebody's fire. I can give him a couple of changes for that. Uh, thank you, sir. Don't spend it all in one place. He's not wondering why this old stiff walking motherfucker came in the park. Meet you by the statue. Great. There's the statue, but no Oz. He said running late. You you seen the statue right there, bro. What are you talking about? Sideways carts make for good seating when there's no bus bench. Let me get a smoke, bro. Nasty smoking, man. Hey. Beat it. Damn. If that's what smoking does to you, I am definitely good, bro. this cobble pop park let's look at this well it isn't what it used to be right uh oh trouble watch wallet cash Oh, this come on, goes man. Through you. Hey, you heard him, man. The hell are you Walk waiting away. for? You're making a mistake. You already made one coming here. The next one kills you. End him. Here we go. Gentlemen. <laughs> Oz. Keep walking, all right? This don't concern you, twerp. You see, that's where you're mistaken. My old mate and I have some catching up to do. Hey, you're oh. you're in the moment! Come here. Oh. Think that'll do? God damn. Oh. There we go. Oh. Stay down! What do I got? Penguins well used to be a nice place. No lives like you don't belong. Damn, cave that fool's face in. This is my park. Mine. You hear that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, Bruce. You've got a little, uh. Hey, good as new. <laughs> this guy. Woo! That was the right little scrap, eh? Yeah. Nothing kickstarts the system like a dash of adrenaline, eh? Well, thanks for the backup. I yanked you away from your bloody ivory tower, Bruce. Least I can do is make sure you don't get shanked. Oh, that's very yeah. thoughtful of you. <laughs> it's been what? Two decades. And you know what? I haven't been mugged once that entire time. <laughs> uh, no, that wasn't why I brought you here, mate. Right now... I am trying to recognize the little Bruce I used to run around this place with. Back when it wasn't, you know, like this. This park used to mean something. A place that was safe for kids, for families. People came from all over to visit. Oh, Mom and Dad, they put so much work in here. It's a shame what happened. It was beautiful once. Yeah. And now it's a hellhole. Last thing my parents ever built. 
<sighs> this city chews right through people. <sighs> Damn. Mum committed to Arkham. Dad. Ended it yourself, he did. My family's fortune. There's nothing left, Bruce. I know. Alfred told me. It's messed up. <sighs> it's funny, huh? Same place that ground my family to dust. Gave you the good life. Used to run in the same circles we did. Hub hey, Northern parties, be, uh, round uh, the world on vacations, me. unlimited potential. My parents are gone too, Oz. I know, Bruce, I know. I'm sorry for it. But I have my own funerals to attend. Good to know you haven't changed, Bruce. You still care about something more than just yourself. Although, I was surprised to see Carmine Falcone at your party last night. Yeah, that surprised me too. Made himself right at home. That oily... <sighs> Falcone was an uninvited guest. That's it. Never want to see his face again. On that, we can agree in earnest. Yeah. Falcone made a stack of cash and corpses a mile high, ruining families like mine. All he needs is a little... Push. Looks like he needs a, he has a bone to pick. It'd be a treat to watch him hit pavement. Sorry, mate. This reunion got a lot more grim than I planned. Things are going to be you on the upswing soon, though. Clean yourself up, bro. A revolution is knocking on Gotham's door. And I'm here to let it in. Which brings me to you, Bruce. You see, you throw a rock in any direction, you break a window that Wayne Enterprises owns. As the rich and powerful go, oh, you top Gotham's list. But when my revolution starts, we're gonna smash windows and cross off names all the way down. Like I said, it's not gonna be pretty. It's gonna be beautiful. I'm not your enemy, Oz. That remains to be seen. Yes, yeah. I've got great affection for you, Bruce. I really do. Which is why I'm warning you. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. This guy. We're already on opposite ends of the pole. Good seeing you, Bruce, but I got some rocks to collect. Cheers. Rocks. He's gonna go smoke some rocks. Oh, you are tripping. <laughs> Press conference for a new hospital to start soon. All right. Well, I think I'm going to leave it off right here. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time in Rompus Room. Bye-bye.